Hello everyone, welcome to CFT and CAT tutorial. Today in this session, I will explain you about the features known as Sketch. Sketch feature is available to any of the CAT based design software and it is very basic uh, steps to uh, proceed in design and uh, even uh, to design 3D uh, objects also you must at first uh, make a sketch of that particular geometry and uh, to start with sketch what you can simply do is select the particular tile over here you can see sketch uh, tile is available here when you click that you can find a bunch of new uh, icon being available to that and so available to that so I am clicking here and uh, this icon uh, is the different commands that is being available inside the sketcher window but uh, by this time you should not worry what these uh, uh, commands actually mean uh, in further uh, videos will explain you uh, about these different commands individually but for today I will explain you just about this sketch and uh, this sketch enables you to open the sketcher window or uh, you can simply see here uh, there is no kind of icon available before you click the sketch but as you click the sketch and uh, you select a particular plane here you'll find a two new uh, icons are being available these icons actually represent that you are inside the window and these icons helps to get out of the window so uh, these particular first icons helps you to exit the window by enabling whatever uh, the sketch you have made to be uh, there itself and uh, this particular icon cross you can see that will enable you to get out of the sketcher and uh, whatever you have made in that particular will be uh, uh, will be deleted so it will not be available there so you can make a use of both the icons uh, as you require and uh, so uh, let me explain you how to draw very simple uh, sketch in the uh, sketcher window so let me select a rectangle so in the rectangle I'll select a first point that I want to start with and the second point so later on we'll uh, try to uh, learn about the smart dimensioning and in that case you can dimension the uh, rectangle in particular dimension as of you required so but today uh, in this session uh, I am not going to explain you about the dimensioning but uh, in further session I will uh, definitely explain you so as you can see I have sketched the uh, uh, rectangle here now I want to get out of this sketch and I want that sketch to be here itself so I am just clicking here now you can see the sketch is available here so again to show what is the uh, importance of the cross icon that was available here I am again going to uh, edit that sketch so uh, you can just simply click on that particular sketch uh, with its name so and click on edit sketch so now again we are getting the uh, that sketch now I will draw one circle over here now if I click on this particular icon I will be getting that circle uh, when I get out of that um, sketch window but when I click to this I will not be getting uh, that particular circle and here is a command so this come uh, this particularly warning uh, says that this discard change to the sketch so whatever we have changed to that sketch I want to discard that so if you discard change and exit just you will not get get that circle so you might have observed the difference so now after that sketch menu you should know uh, is about these different planes available here you can see by default there are three different plane uh, defined uh, in the SOLIDWORKS and uh, basically in all other CAD based software will have these three plane by default defined and uh, later you can see that you can define your own new planes also but uh, that is also uh, will be shown in next videos so whatever these front plane top plane right planes 
means uh, is that the particular pen on which you can make the sketches and to know detail about these kind of planes you can uh, refer to machine drawing textbook or CAD textbook or uh, you can simply go through some of the web sources and uh, hopefully uh, you might go through all those so that it will be easy for you to uh, learn these softwares very easily so mm, let me at first click with this particular plane this is the front plane and uh, let me explain what is the different icon that has been available to you there are basically four different uh, icon that has been available to you as you click on this particular plane so first one is to sketch in that particular plane second one is to hide or show that particular plane third is to zoom that particular plane and fourth one is to normal to normal to means a uh, view that gets you normal to that particular pen I will explain you uh, about this also so uh, say here the plane should be represented in the form of two dimensional like a rectangle you can uh, you can see uh, here so this is in the form of rectangle means we are normal to the top plane but we are not normal to the front plane so front plane is being uh, represented in the form of a line but that is not a correct way so if you want to sketch on that particular plane you have to at first click on this normal to icon so you can see now you are in the front plane and now if you want to sketch you can simply sketch anything uh, over here so now uh, I have sketched a line and I am just exiting the sketch so it is now available thank you guys for watching this video i hope this video was useful to you please subscribe my channel for further videos and please do not forget to refer online web sources for your better understanding